Jordan. I've been trying to write this thank you letter for a while now, but I don't even know where to begin. July 20th, 2021 is a little bit of a blur to me, and honestly, I wish I could forget it all. The one thing that I'll always remember is the greeting we got from you on our way to the ER. You could see the fear and sadness in my eyes as we walked through the door. Instead of greeting us with a smile and a chipper attitude, you immediately joined us in our fear and sadness and became part of our journey. I did not need the everything is going to be okay speech and you knew that. My world was falling apart and you were there to help pick up the pieces. I remember just sitting down on the couch, covering my face with my hands and crying uncontrollably while you and a few other nurses immediately started loving on Baylor and making her feel as comfortable as possible while I had my much needed meltdown. You are the nurse me and my family needed in this moment. We spent the next 25 days in Covenant's care and there was not a day that went by that we weren't provided with the best care possible. You and many other nurses made our journey so much easier. You made sure to check on us and Baylor every time you were on shift. We felt more love and support than I could ever have imagined. I just want to make sure you know how much of an impact you had on me and my family. It takes such a special person to do what you do, and I thank God every day for letting our paths cross. We could not have done it without you and the care and support that you all provided us. We are only one family of many that you've left an impact on. Thank you for doing what you do. We are forever grateful for you and Covenant. Love, the Buckners. Baylor is just an infectious person. When you walk in the room, even when she's having a bad day, she's usually will kind of give you a look or uh, just give you that sweet smile and she's so easy to play with. Uh, I mean, even when we're giving her her treatment or things like that, she's um, just makes the job fun. I have a son that's close to uh, Baylor's age and um, I just remember thinking to myself, this could easily be anybody's kid. This easily could be my kid. And what would I need in that time of um, despair? And just, I'm just glad that I could be there for them in that moment. I love what I get to do so much. And just being with people in their hardest moments of their lives. Nobody wants to hear those words. Nobody wants their kids ever to be sick. So it's just meaningful to me to know that I make an impact on um, the worst day of someone's life, pretty much.